In 2015, August precisely, I was flying from the United States to my home country, Nigeria. It was a very long flight. So I got in a conversation with the Lord. Previously, for several months, the Lord has been telling me that he wants me to move to a new level in my ministry. And I was, I was in my comfort zone. It was comfortable where I was. I didn't want to make that change. The Lord told me that you must remember that I am the one who made a way for you. And I'm still the way maker. I am the promise keeper. When I say something that I'm going to do something, I'm going to do it. The Lord had told me that he was going to make me a story of his grace and favor. So I wrote the song in my heart. And who knew that this will become a song that will assure the whole world? Way maker, miracle worker, promise keeper, I the God. My God, my God is who you are. writing songs for a long time. I have catalogs and catalogs of songs. And um, while we were singing some of the songs, they were making a lot of waves. But this one was different, you know. He just went, um, I guess when the Lord wants to introduce you differently, he does it in his own way. to tell me something he told me that when he called Abraham Abraham then he wasn't Abraham yet he said he's, he told him to leave his people his comfort zone and he took him out to a place where he would show him he didn't even explain everything you know and he said to him I'll make you famous that's what he said. I'm going to make you famous. I'm going to make your name known. I'm going to make you great. All that promises. Everybody started singing it from different places. People are translating it in different languages. So. just taught me that um, you can never outdo God when you decide to believe him for what he said he is and who he said he is and what he said he will do that he will do and so um, I've seen myself from being a young little girl in Africa so able to 
overcome my environment. Believing in the pictures that God showed me, that what he was going to do with me, he was going to do with me. And so my story is that I'm doing what I'm doing from Africa and touching the whole world, which has never been done before.